presenting our national officials for this match. First referee, Mr. Fernando Velarde. Second referee, Mr. Mark Santos. Let's welcome our starting lineup from our strong group, Athletics. Let's begin with our team captain. She wears jersey number 14, Dolly Grace Versoza. At number 7, Justine Andrea Rebleza. Wearing jersey number 9, Chumsi Ann Kaule. At number 11, Shika Espinosa. Wearing jersey number 17, Mary Joy Onofre. And at number 19, Nikki Baldizanzo. Starting libero is number 3, Melanie Romero. Head coach, Mr. Rogelio Coach Onyok Ketigan. Presenting our Farm Fresh Foxies. Let's begin with jersey number five, Eliza Bertolano. At number 10, Ginny Arroyo. Wearing jersey number 12, Trisha Gail Tubu. Number 13, April Tagsip. At number 16, Riza Andrea Cruz. And at number 21, Angelica Legachon. Starting libero is number 17, Janelle Delerio. Head coach, Mr. Jerry Yi. This match is under the supervision and regulation of the Games and Amusements Board. Match. Seven. Strong group athletics going up against the Farm Fresh Foxies, the penultimate game for both squads here in the uh, first part of the PBL All Filipino Conference on Philippines Live. Of course, you saw the starters for Strong Group, and on your screens, the first uh, unit for Farm Fresh, no different from uh, the usual suspects that we see. Important for both teams, really. Strong Group still looking for their first win ish, and Farm Fresh has had a lot of bad luck, shall we say, the past games, and they just want to, like we said, uh, end on a high. Oh, yeah, uh, the Farm Fresh Foxes are riding on a five game losing streak. Now they want to win this game uh, towards the end of this conference. Uh, para wadag dagan naman yung two wins na goal ni PL Defonso from that last VTR uh, after that huge win against the charity crossovers. Yeah. Kind of stumbled, no? Uh, in the, their last five games. So they have to find their group. Oh, huge win. And if we remember, the early in this tournament, naka one set sila against Creamline. Yeah. And of course, all of the potential we are already we've already seen from Farm Fresh. Kaya they have a lot that they are anchoring on, and so much potential. Like Trish Tubu there, we know she was a star from her Adamson uh, Lady Falcons days, and she starts strong today. Well, starting off with a kill block uh, against the top scorer of strong group in uh, Versosa. That's a good sign for the Foxes to start us off here in this game. Good defense there, nice dig. And we highlighted Versosa, so she is also marked. Binabantayan din siya. And a strong defense paying off here for Farm Fresh. And we like the Libero's effort. That's a good save from uh, the Farm Fresh Foxies. Yeah. Just a smart play coming from Arroyo. Like a Sean there with a nice up. Trish Tubu off speed. That's the good uh, decision there for Trish Tubu getting a quick point. That's two in a row for Trish. And we started talking about Janelle Delario, the libero of Farm Fresh, who is actually the ninth best digger and receiver in the field, which is something uh, to be proud of. Pag nakatap ten ka ish. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, those are back to back placement shots from the Foxes. And again, a kill block on the left side 
to start us off here at 4-0. A very strong start here from the Foxies. Parang ramdam mo yung resolve ng Farm Fresh to really uh, leave today with a W after five uh, straight losses like you mentioned. And here they go on offense again. Quick transition there. Back to Tubu, who pounds on the pavement there. Trish is already with three points. Well, Trisha Tubu with a powerful cross court hit here. Timeout. Padaan mo sa kanya. Padaan mo lang. Di pagano, bigyan mo. Hindi yung obus na obus na doon kagad yung play mo. Paikutin mo, pwede yung pagpagtrasin niya. Paikutin mo to. Ha? Then back row attack, pwede tayo. Strong group as of yet, really not able to set up and play proper offense. They are struggling uh, to keep up with uh, the net defense and the floor defense of the Farm Fresh Foxes. That's why they're not able to score a point here yet uh, in the first set. Chistubu will go again. Three points already. That one is still called inside. Going deep now to zone six. And so far, it's 100% for Chistubu. And let's uh, turn it over to Sam Corrales with an early report. Gusto kong ipakilala kung sino ako. These were the words Chini Arroyo told me when I asked her about being the bright spot for the Farm Fresh Foxes. Hindi daw pwedeng mawala ng fighting spirit, lalo na if walang laro ang isa sa mga teammates nila. If one is lacking in that department, Chini said that they need to be ready to back each other up because of the five consecutive losses that they suffered, which really hurt their pride. So now Chini hopes that they can finally put an end to that today. And with their strong start, let's see if they could keep this up in today's match, which you can watch on Filipinas Live for 149 pesos a month. Back to you, Chicken Inch. Thank you, Sam. So this is what it looks like when you're playing for Pride Inch. Oh, these teams are sister teams, no? For uh, uh -uh. you Pride din nandun eh. Uh, both of these teams want to take that W home. So far, Farm Fresh looking good in this effort. And strong group. They're looking to get going. They have a point already, but they're not able to get them in streaks. Paisa isa lang and Farm Fresh quickly getting us to our first technical timeout. Arena Plus, Astig sa Sports. And we are back here at the Araneta Coliseum. Chiki Rawapuno with Ish Polvorosa, Sam Corrales. And this place will be rocking in just a couple of hours as we await the big showdown between Choco Mucho and Creamline. Uh, different story this time with Choco Mucho actually in the lead and Creamline not at the top spot, which is something that many are not used to. And so that's what we are looking forward to. Meantime, we got these uh, two teams, another pair of sister teams ish, who are at it. Uh, sister teams day. Today. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
Strong group still looking to improve their uh, score here. Sapalang so far, and they're going to get their second point off an error. Oh, no, there's a. It's an off the block kill. Oh, oh. Yeah. Uh, for the Foxies. This is a blowout so far. Eight point lead for Farm Fresh. Oh, look at that. Chini Arroyo, we've been highlighting her today and how she has come into her own uh, compared to or in contrast to her um, role in her former team F2, which is yun nga, parang hindi siya masyadong binigyan ng pagkakataon yeah. doon. She's got more playing time here, mm -hmm. playing for the Foxies. That's a good pickup. So Chini Arroyo showing even her defense and Trish Tubo just keeps uh, going. Five points are ready for Trish. Tubu again attacking from the right pin. This time moving down the line. What about Legashon's setting? So far, so good for Legashon of Farm Fresh. So it's Legashon now calling the shots, not Louis Romero on the side of Farm Fresh. And that is. Uh, Earn point there for strong group. Look good. That combination attack. Oh, that's a smart play there from the right wing. You have to utilize that kind of an attack more, no? Para masira din yung defense ng farm fresh. Good effort at the block here. And Kane there was denied by the blocking of Farm Fresh. Ball back to Strong Group. They get another chance. Ball right back to Farm Fresh. Tubu goes. She is dug this time. Back set. Aslan there. First rally that we saw here. We see the effort of Strong Group. I mean, nakikita mo naman na if they're committed, na talagang pwede naman nilang pahabain pa yung mga rally. Yeah, they were there at the net. Their first defense was ready. It's so just that Trisha Tubu was just the handle and that last attack from the right wing. You know, I think Trish Tubu is 100% so far. Everything that uh, she is given, she's able to convert. Remember how we started off this game with that solo block by Trish Tubu. Good defense by Chini Arroyo. Kane will go, and that one is outside. It's a little too long. Yeah, there's a block touch called on Trisha Tubu. That's a good point there from the Athletics. It's one point for Kane, who, by the way, did not see uh, action in the past game. Buhay pa rin. A little too late on that pancake by Onofre. And that point will be credited to Eliza Bertolano, her second today. No, Bertolano just uh, doing an off speed hit uh, going to the middle. And the floor defense of Strong Group wasn't ready for that kill. Mui. Pacini Arroyo so far doing really well in the back row. Oh. Nasayangan ka doon. Yeah. And uh, error on the attack. A little trouble there by Dali Versosa hitting from back row. Oh, a strong group playing uh, a bit more tense no? mm. uh, in this opening set. Unlike uh, the farm fresh fox, he's just playing like a well-oiled machine yeah. here in set number one. I think that's a perfect uh, description. And this is the first error by Trish Tubu on the uh, uh, serve. Oh, they cannot rely on just the unforced errors of Farm Fresh to uh, take some points away from the Foxies. Good first ball. Ooh. Good up there by Versosa, but the ball will go right back to Farm Fresh and Legacion pushing it to Liza Bertolano. Good save. Versosa playing oh. really well in back row. 
Look at Chini Versosa go there. An error here. Miscue for Farm Fresh to end that rally. A rare uh, miscue there on the part of Legacion uh, and Bertolano. Nobody was ready for that set. Yeah, we got a glimpse of Coach Jerry Yi there, who probably should be standing right in the middle of the court. Because <laughs> he also a strong group to rally up the yeah. players and find uh, the, you know, to fill the roster. No, that was an effort that, that Jerry Yi also helped in. Again, these unforced errors are not helping their cause here. Talking about strong group athletics in the first set. It's interesting, Sam Corrales mentioned earlier that Farm Fresh is really just playing for pride. Na talaga sigurong na hurt or nasaktan because of the five straight losses and the last one against a relatively or parang a, a team, a galleries that they thought they'd be able yeah. to conquer. Na tapos na straight sila. Looking back at the last game that Farm Fresh played against the Galleries Tower High Risers, it was a three-setter. Galleries winning 25-18, 25-23, 25-16. So I'm sure that uh, is still hurting for yeah. Farm Fresh. Could have already reached that <laughs> goal of mm -hmm. Farm Fresh. And we are at our second deck. Awesome live sports viewing is guaranteed with Signal yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Switch now and get up to three months with no cash out. Visit www.signal.tv slash switch for more details. And that is just a glimpse of what is to come. Choco Mucho Flying Titans, some of the members early at the Araneta, just uh, taking it easy and relaxing, enjoying the action here on the court. Halo-halo, makakatabi sila ngayon. Yeah. Friends sila ngayon. <clears throat> Farm Fresh strong group, as you mentioned, also sister teams, but uh, not in the next couple of sets. Both wanting a W in their second to the last game. Rososa is at the front now. And good rebound there. At least Napapa Bagal Narinambola. A strong group. The dip. Defense working for Farm Fresh. And that's off the block. Another point for Farm Fresh. But you appreciate strong group now for really uh, trying and keeping their eye on the ball. Yeah, uh, the problem with the south side now, strong group, is they cannot seem to convert uh, their good floor defense to attack points. That's why they're just uh, waiting for Farm Fresh to attack from everywhere. Oh! Good read by Trish Tubu there at one two play. And this time easily picked up by Bartolano. But the error at the net there. Baldisanzo will get that point. Oh, reading that set uh, perfectly well from the middle. Uh, Baldisanzo just waiting for that B quick set from the Gashon to cruise. <laughs> Oh, that's the De Los Reyes. Check that. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then 
talk about the transition. That's what seems to be working for Farm Fresh. Ambilis nilang maka-transition to offense. That's Bike of the Set, brought to you by Duncan Pasalubong ng Bayan. Again, it's Dilas Reyes, second attempt earlier. She was blocked by Baltizanzo. But this time, she's ready and uh, quick enough for that point for Farm Fresh. It has been smooth sailing here for Farm Fresh in the first set. They are bound and determined to get a win after a five-game skid. Well, that was a long back set, the right pin, and Tapia was just waiting there for that block. Shustubu definitely waxing hot today with her seventh point. <laughs> Uh, she has been the go-to girl here for the Farm Fresh Foxes in the opening set. Mars Alba is enjoying the action and the fans enjoying seeing Mars enjoy the action also here at the Araneta uh, Coliseum. And we also saw a glimpse already of some of the Choco Mucho Flying Titans. And I think Creamline's already here because we saw Laurie yeah. Bernardo sitting with them already. So ready na sila, ready na rin ang fans. Napupuno na tayo dito sa Big Dome. And I'm sure these two teams also enjoying the benefit of having a crowd cheering them on and watching them play. Yeah. Uh, the tension is on uh, mm -hmm. for the fans as well of the pink uh, from the Green Line Coast Smashers and of course the purple for the Chocolate and the Flying Titans. But before that, we have strong group in Farm Fresh. Malayo na masyado itong labang ng Farm Fresh na in set number one. A lot of attack points coming from everybody, literally, from the side of the Foxies. Of course, nangunguna Trish Tubu. That's point number eight for Trish. That set was too tight, uh, close to the net and the antenna, but nagawa niya ng paraan, swiped it off the block of strong group for that point. Unfortunately for their sister team, the strong group, no? Farm Fresh is looking at the athletics as uh, their, their whipping boys of sort. Kasi parang kailangan talaga nila ng uh, tatanggap nung ano eh. Who will take the heat for all of the frustration of that five-game skid of Farm Fresh. Oh, still alive. Tubo again. This time going off speed. Good defense here. But sending the ball over. A strong group not able to transition to offense. And that's what happens. That's a good attack uh, from El Defonso. Just targeting the end zone of the cross court area. The defense and a strong group. Contributing right away from the left wing. So we saw Tapia. We saw El Defonso. New players coming in. In this first set for Farm Fresh. Good pickup. Also, the other libero seeing action. Julia Angeles. First challenge we are seeing today coming from Farm Fresh, who is leading by uh, a lot. This is a 14 point lead. Farm Fresh nearing the 25 point mark, but we will pause for this video challenge. Very interesting 
tournament we have, the All-Filipino Conference, has been so unpredictable-ish. Oh, it truly has been unpredictable, mm. no? In the in. Yeah, mm -hmm. good challenge there from the coaching staff in the Forum Fresh Foxies. I also thought that it got the line. Yeah. But unpredictable because while we already have um, pretty much identified the five teams as Daddy Danny always present supporting his athletic athletic kids. Uh, we were saying no that we already have identified the five teams who are still battling it out for the top four. Yeah. Dimo pa rin mala. It could really be anybody from the lower three, no? Ang sigurado siguro at this point is Choco Mucho. No, they are already in the uh -oh. semifinals. Yes, no? and is Petrogas sure to Pe stay? Uh, in my opinion, they're at a very good spot, mm. very good position, taking the number two spot, no? So it's just between the three teams, eh? PLDT, Creamline, and uh, the Cherry, Cherry. The crossover. Yeah. Uh, signal, unfortunately. Most likely will not make it into the semi-finals because they already have four losses yeah, in this yeah, contest. That loss yesterday. And Tubu blocked. Oh. That's gonna be a block point for Onofre. Oh, we haven't seen a lot of that no a kill block against the top scorer of the Farm Fresh Fox CC and Trisha Tubu. Sara. Sara the cross guard. That was a good block. Mm. Still set point though for Farm Fresh. Let's see if they can end it now. Good first ball from Ildefonso setting up that kill. <laughs> Good control there from the pass in the set. What a kill coming from Delos Reyes off of that B quick targeting zone one with power. Yeah, it all started with a good pass from Ildefonso, and that is a win in the first. Very resounding win by Farm Fresh. Take a look at the highlights. Well, we could see that there was uh, that giggle now from the side of the Farm Fresh Foxies. They showed us that they badly want to win this game against their sister team in the strong group athletics. Uh, they scored from everywhere, from the middle hits to the wing attackers. And uh, Lega Shot being fielded in by Gosh Jerry, but instantly contributing in the setting department. Uh, the strong group athletics just did not handle uh, the poor defense and the blocking of Farm Fresh. Hindi rin sila convert masyado sa atake, uh, masyadong uh, nag-aalangan when it comes to attacking. Kita-kita naman natin dito sa set number one statistics. 
10 point deficit when it comes to attacking. 14 for Farm Fresh, only 4 for Strong Group. Blocking lamang nindo yung Farm Fresh. 3 to 1. Aces, uh, Farm Fresh tallied an ace. And uh, 7 free points given to the Foxies. 5 free points given to Strong Group. And that was a very lopsided first set uh, for the Farm Fresh Foxies against Strong Group. Yeah, you know, the thing that uh, really was very noticeable as we uh, take a look at uh, the si, uh, lagi naman nandito yung ating tatay tatay hindi to si, si uh, Ricky Palu and coach uh, oh, oh. Godfrey Pumu. It was really impressive how Farm Fresh was so committed in their defense because that really got all of the plays started. No, maganda yung nalaro nila sa kanilang floor coverage kaya nakakapag transition sila na maigi. There wasn't much of a challenge no, from uh, the serves and the attacks of strong group. That's why they're able to create uh, these uh, plays, uh, combination plays from everywhere. Uh, talking about the Farm Fresh Foxy. So strong group has to load up on their serves and be more confident when it comes to attacking. Didn't see too many errors on the serve in the first set, but early in the second, Chini Arroyo already hitting the serve into the net and that's a break for strong group <laughs> Bertolano is blocked and that's a good way for a strong group to get started in this second set good for them to be able to taste the lead Tallying a kill block there. So far, Razlan, the leading scorer for Strong Group with three points, and Trisha Tubu with seven. Or make that eight for the Foxies. Kasi naka one block siya. Yeah. Yeah. Tagsip on the court now. Of course, you know, Tagsip, one of the taller players here. There, you know, Farm Fresh is really a good opportunity to experiment and to try all of the different combination plays that they have. Meantime, let's turn it over to Sam Corrales. Down to their last two games, Dolly Versosa told me that they just need to enjoy a bit more and make the most of their experience. Now, despite the beating that we saw in the first set, Dolly still shared with me before the game that this is a matchup she's personally looking forward to. And that is because ever since high school, she already went up against the Adamson core and they really stood out for her. But despite being sister teams now, as you guys mentioned, it's all about business today. And Dolly said not to count them out just yet as they set their sights on that elusive first win in the pros. Now let's see if they can turn things around here in this set and you can witness the action on the Filipinas live app for 149 pesos a month. Back to you, Chicken Ish. We are definitely not counting them out, Sam, as they are already leading in the second set. And fortunately for them at service error, at this point they really cannot afford to lose points on unforced errors. Yeah. What they want is to create that momentum for them to catch up or uh, uh, that separation that they need against the Farm Fresh Foxes here in set number two. Oh. Tough. That one landed outside. So these wasted opportunities, yeah. really. Again, another unforced error this time from the second ball. A strong group. Lead down to one. Farm Fresh winning that first game. 25-10, first set. Yeah. Rososa timing it, a little far from the net. Easy pickings for Chini. Tubu again, and this is a dangerous rotation where Tubu is just banging away from the right pin. Oh, the Needed that point to tie this up at four, and the Gashon just ready for that kill. Spike of the set brought to you by Duncan Pasalubong ng Bayan. Oh! Wow. That's their second unforced air from the second ball. Yeah. That's gotta hurt for a strong group. They cannot uh, create the plays that they need to score. 
uh, the attack points here in the second set. Yeah, at this point, they're already doing it to themselves. Kumbaga shooting themselves in the foot. Tolano has a good dig. Oh, Kaole, you know, that was a difficult one handed set. Nilang nabigyan ng pagkakata on, no? Nasayang yung effort ni Kaole. And we have another timeout. Pagka nag set ka ng play, sigurado. Kahit na alangan niyo yung bola, pasukan mo quicker. Kung di mo ka yung iba to doon, di opener na lang. Opener na lang pagka di mo alanganin ka. O kaya back row attack. Nagko-convert na ng error pag gano'n eh. Convert tayo, may pasa na tayo. May pasa naman eh. Ba Ba't nahihirapan ba? Convert tayo, attack eh. Kung magagay. Kung di sigurado yung backslide. O di, bigwit na lang. O eh. Let's go! 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 The postseason of the association is almost here. Watch the 2024 NBA playoffs starting April 20th only on NBA TV Philippines. One Sports and Filipinas Live. Hashtag everyone's game. Hashtag NBA on Signal. Park Fresh has taken over the lead. It was a strong start for strong group in set number two. But Farm Fresh seemed to determine, uh, too determined to win today. Back row attack. Hindi na balik ni Arroyo. So yun yung sabi ni Coach kanina. Kapag hindi tayo masyadong sigurado sa na-set up na play, we have another option from the back row, from the left pin. Huwag na natin masyadong gawing komplikado yung sets because uh, they committed three unforced errors yeah. from the second balls. Yeah, that was a good time out. A strong group and the girls responding. That's Bertolano from the left side. Off the block kill. Smartly using the double block of strong group for that point. I mean, you like that strong group is kaya papano challenging them. Sige, hit it off the block. At least that means you put a block up yeah. against them. And uh, this is a, a good uh, attacking form uh, for strong group. Unlike uh, what they did in the first set. Masyado na lang pinalayo kagad yung labang ng Farm Fresh this time. They're hitting it down the line, cross court, and they're blocking as well. Good start here in set number two for Strong Group. You might say it is also a matter of pride for them. Huwag naman kayo magpaiwan ng ganun. Yeah. Uh, good blocking, blocking. Yeah. yeah. Arroyo from back row, getting the defense that Strong Group has been able to show. But that one, Ball right back to them. Just good uh, net defense coming from Farm Fresh, getting them to eight points. Arena Plus, Astig sa Sports. Back here at the Big Dome, Chiki Roa Puno with Ish Polveros and Sam Corrales for the first of our double header. And we got a good crowd here. Interesting crowd. Uh, the ladies from the Farm Fresh Foxies uh, supporting mm -hmm. their sisters on the floor. Oh, ito yung mga hindi pa nagpapakita. Yeah. But apart from uh, the Farm Fresh Foxies, we talked about how 
really the big dome is going to be rocking today and nandito they've already come out many of the fans of choco mucho and creamline already enjoying the action here in our first game which is getting heated mas tumatapat ngayon ang strong group espinosa there getting a point her first today her second rather first in this second set that's a good transition play from the strong group athletic squad. It's Espinosa targeting that cross for the left pin. Good strategy there, no? Yung sabi ni coach kanina, make it simple and just attack smartly and with power kung kinakailangan. Back set. Back row there, Bertolano getting that one easily and Cruz hitting it off the block. Cruz, yeah, with that running kill, like Sean rotating her attackers, no? not just from the wing, uh, from the pins. There are middles that can contribute for their attack points. And that one is outside. So Sardinia tried but could not get a check ball there. Farm Fresh now up by three. Good defense shown by the Athletics. And pagandang hulo kay Legacion. First one to play we're seeing from Farm Fresh. Looks like Legacion will be getting a lot of playing time today. She has stayed on the court since set one. Luis Romero making it easy today. That took a peek there before she went for that drop ball. Talking about Legacion. Oh, another free ball here for the Foxies. To get the depth at the double block, Muntik Knight almost fell inside the court of Farm Fresh, but not quite. And Chini Arroyo will be credited with that point. <laughs> Espinosa going again. Bertolano with a good save. Again, hitting off the block. And we're seeing the motion of the blockers, the front row of strong group. Alam nila na they have to close in on the block a little better. Kailangan pa yung pa. There are gaps uh, in front of Arroyo's uh, path for that attack from the left pin. No? Pwedeng mag down the line or din sa seam. So they have to close out their blocks properly. Back row, Eliza Bertolano finding zone one. Empty there. That's a good control for Bertolano coming from all the way in the back and finding her spot. Timeout. big blocks. Basta option mo, back or attack. Dalawin na spiker mo, di ba? Padalawin mo siya. Pwede mo siya maging. Brace yourselves as athletes and sports lovers have no holds barred conversations with Sean Ildefonso. Watch Sean Time, exclusive on Filipinas Live app. Download and subscribe now. Before that, enjoy the action from Sean's sister, Pia Ildefonso, who, of course, is a part of Farm Fresh. She was able to get a couple of minutes earlier in the first set. We hope to see her on the court again. But meantime, like a Sean also playing the uh, playmaker, and she is in the front seat here for Farm Fresh. Strong group will score a point after that mini rally. It's a good option for a strong group. That's what they wanted from that time out. But they must do that option from the back row uh, to score some attack points. And uh, 
instantly scoring from the right side of the back row. Ooh. Oh, wow. A nice hit there from Arroyo again from the left side. Surely uh, she targeted that seam in between the block. There. Yeah, just quick action there. Ang bilis ng contact niya sa bola, hindi na nakahabol yung blockers. Persosa. Seeing a lot of uh, effort from Hakulan and the rest of a strong group to try to make up the points that they've lost. We remember that they led by three early in this second set. Oh, too hard for Kaule there. Just too near the net. And Tubu, good defense there, good blocking. Good heads up by Haukulan. Look at the effort of strong group here to keep the ball in play. And sabi mo, ito yung transition. Nahihirapan sila to really make the most of the defensive effort. We are at 16-9, Farm Fresh up by 7. Dome. You're seeing the crowd form here. It is going to get wild here in just a little bit as Chocomucho takes on Creamline in our main game. But before that, we've got Farm Fresh Foxies going up against their sister team, the Strong Group Athletics. It was a good start for Strong Group in the second set with a 4-1 uh, to one lead, but things have gone the other way. 16-9 is the score. Farm Fresh with the lead. And they want to end early. They want a streak here, a three-game uh, set, a three-game match. And it looks like they are dominating in the second set already. First game went 25-10 for set, that is. Meantime, good news for all volleyball fans. The PVL, UAAP, and Spikers turf can now be enjoyed on One Sports via high definition. Catch the games on One Sports HD Channel 17 only on Signal. One Sports HD is available to all active Signal prepaid and postpaid subscribers. Nice one there from sport, uh, from the Athletics. That one is inside again, that very vulnerable zone one, that corner pocket. Sometimes you say the tendency if you have a single block to uh, no block coverage is to make sure na yung front defense walang ane eh, butas. Mm. Pero nakita rin yung attackers, eh, that's why they target the end zones of the court. Which alam natin hindi madali eh, kasi madaling lumagpas yun kung gusto mo talagang long ball. Takes some mastery, and Tishtubu has been very, very precise today. Good defense despite the combination attacks from Farm Fresh. Paid off for the Athletics, and Versosa will score her third point. Well, that's a good off the block kill from the left pin. 
Lions targeting the high blocking hands of Cruz in that last play. No. This is going to be almost an ace here, a chance again for strong group. Oh, that went beyond the antenna, so that point goes to the farm fresh foxies. Sayang because uh, they had that opportunity to convert that on a top point. And we are hearing the cheering of the, I would venture to say, the Chocomucho crowd. Probably just everybody here uh, seeing Kate Murray step on the court. Louis Romero also on the court now. Go! Oh. Right away. Wow. Point here. That move brought to you by Honda Motorcycle. One more time on that. Double block. Kate Mirai coming in and making instant impact for Farm Fresh. Of course, with Risa Cruz on that double block. No, this is a good time to maximize their middle attack. So talking about strong group, especially when they have the perfect pass uh, to the setter. on Onofre off that be quick. Kate Santiago also already on the court here for Farm Fresh. Back row attack by Versosa. Another chance here. Kate Burai will go again and she will score. <laughs> and get a magic move. Yeah. The ride, the turning of the crowd here in set number two for the Farm Fresh Foxies going cross court for that point. Kate Santiago, we talk about the Adamson core, the very strong Adamson core, and Kate Santiago also central in that. Of course, she also with, uh, has a service error to start off here, so just still a little cold. Papa Inet Pasikate. On the other hand, Onofre will score on a service ace. That's her third point. Yeah, that's a good point for Onofre earlier. She had an uh, attack point from the beat quick. This time it's a service ace. That's what they need to do more. Uh, load up on their serve so that Farm Fresh would have a hard time uh, creating combination plays. And that one's outside, but with a check ball, that's going to be a side out for Farm Fresh. And they have a seven point advantage here. But this is already a better performance for Strong Group. First set ended 25 10. Kaula choosing Espinosa, double block, working. Virai and Taksit coming together this time. That's a good close out on the left pin against Espinosa. The coverage of strong group, not ready again after that kill block from Caitlin Virai. Farm Fresh three points away from taking the second set. This time, good coverage by Romero, the libero of strong group. Taksip will get her third point. Oh, that's a good variation of the setting coming from Louis Romero this time. It's a peak quick at Taksip, and she goes for an off the block kill from the middle. Good serve for Sosa handled that one though. And unanswered. And Raslan, we featured her in the, our free game, six points already. And this is what we love to see. You mentioned Ish that Raslan it wasn't even a starter in uh, the first part of the season. And now she is the highest scorer for strong group so far with six points. Well, uh, she has an option attacking from the back row. Uh, of course, from the front row, she attacks as well. That's why she, so far she is the, attack, the leading attacking scorer for a strong group. And as I say that, it's Caitlin Virai from the right side of the net again with a point. 
A down the line kill from Louis Romero. Nothing but good things coming out of Kate Larai, but did you see that set? Of course you saw that yeah. set-ish. Ganda, no? Oh, and now service aces. <laughs> and quickly, I mean, how long has Kate been on the yeah. board? And she already has four points. A quick attack point, service point, and block point for Caitlin be right here in the second set. And uh, that'll do it for set number two. A little bit of a challenge uh, posed by Strong Group early on. Twenty five ten, twenty five fifteen, Farm Fresh Foxies having a very good game. And this is in contrast uh, to the last five games that we've seen from the Foxies. And they are determined to end with a bang today. And they are on the road to that. No, oh, they are uh, starting very strong here in this game, uh, taking the Two sets away from the strong group athletics, 25 to 10, 25 to 15. No, and dami paring atake ng uh, farm fresh. But so far, lumalaban pa on the strong group in the second set. We saw how they blocked as well some of the attacks of farm fresh and attacked uh, as well from the wings and from the middle. Uh, as we take a look at set number two statistics, farm fresh still leading in the attacking department, 14 to 11, as well as. Uh, the blocking department, 3 to 1, aces, they're tied there at 1 apiece. Again, these unforced errors, no? a couple of them coming from the second balls no? mm -hmm. at the start of this second set. No? 7 free points given to the Foxes and only a couple given to the strong group athletic squad. So that set, well, they posed a bit of a challenge, no? uh, mm -hmm. especially in the first parts and the middle part of the second set. But strong group, uh, Farm Fresh rather, slowly pulled away in yeah. the latter part of the second set. Kudutusin is yung seven errors. It's uh, almost uh, 
forgivable or hindi naman yun glaring, no? Yeah. Pero tignan mo yung effort ng Farm Fresh to play a clean game with only two errors when it is really strong group who is struggling in this matchup. And I think that is a tall order. That is the order of the day, I think, for the athletics to really just play a cleaner game. Uh, you can just see uh, that the Farm Fresh squad is the more matured mm -hmm. uh, team here in this matchup. No? Uh, they have a couple of talents in the roster. The strong group athletic squad you know, are the newbies in this conference. Yeah. No? But then again, nothing to take away from them slowly. Uh, they are taking away some learnings in this conference and especially from this game against their sister team uh, in the Farm Fresh Foxies. Oh, definitely wins and um, growth is not seen in the number of games that, that you actually are able to, uh, to win, no? Hindi lang doon eh. Ang dami na, you can say for certain that Strong Group is already a better team today than they were when they first started. And that is the kind of growth that uh, they look forward to. And that is something that will serve them when they go into the next conference. And she's too who tried to do it all alone again like she did at the start of this matchup. Oh, what about Rasland though? This time from the left wing. That is her seventh point of the match, the leading scorer for the strong group athletics. Take this one back on the court. Calling the shots for Farm Fresh. Bertolano with a good save. Chini Arroyo. She will get that point again despite the two man block that is put against her. That is her sixth uh, point of the match here against Strong Group, uh, helping out Trisha Tuvio in the scoring department. Uh, the only uh, double-digit scorer so far from both squads, you know, Trisha Tubu from the right wing. That was a good serve. Let's see if this side of the court is going to be better for Strong Group. And it's Farm Fresh looking for a touch. Will they get it? Sam Corrales is ready with her report. Okay, we're going to see how this block touch challenge goes before we turn it over to Sam. And this is only the second challenge we've seen so far. Ish, medyo hindi tayo masyado nakakakita ng mga video challenge. Sam, are you ready? All good, yes. Now, earlier, Chicken Ish, you were talking about Farm Fresh adapting to different situations. And I got to ask Louis Romero about this. And Louis said that this is not easy at all and it does not happen overnight, especially as a setter. Sabi niya, whether it is their first six or it is their bench seeing action, kailan talagang magtulungan sa court. And if there's anything Farm Fresh needs to finally bounce back, Louis kept it simple and just said it all boils down to teamwork. Now, catch the final stretch of the pre Prelims on Filipinas Live for 149 pesos a month ish. I want to ask you a question as a setter like Louis. What can you say about your thoughts on this? Back to you guys. Oh, well, as a setter, Sam, no, I have to agree with her that no matter who the playmaker or the attackers on the floor, kailangan lahat uh, nakadepende doon at existing sa sistema to get uh, the double use that they want and they need. Uh, <laughs> As a matter of fact, you know, volleyball is a team sport. Yeah, so, so much so yeah. that hindi nga naglalaro si Louis <laughs> Romero ngayon. Exactly. Just to, diba? just to make that point even clearer. And what's uh, important is, no, you know, for the fans out there, this is a fact, no. Uh, we only see six or seven uh, oh. na naglalaro sa loob ng court, mm. but the other teammates they play in the trainings, yeah. the scrimmages, uh, lahat yan magkakasama sa hirap at ginhawa. So, alam nila yung tendencies and strengths and weaknesses ng teammates nila. That is so yes. true. That is so true. At sino rin ba ang magcha-challenge dun sa core unit exactly. in training yeah. kung hindi yung mga teammates mo rin. So, the teamwork that we're talking about is not just how they work together as a unit on the court, but Everything that happens off the court. Yes, the and preparations matter as well. Ah, take it from Ish, who is, by the way, very uh, hot and right in it, <laughs> in the action at the Spikers' turf. And we look forward to their games. Pagdaman natin, bukas may laro din si Ish. Yes. And we look forward to that against uh, 
the PGJC Navy. Meantime, Tristubu, she remains to be the only double-digit scorer so far with 12 points. Uh, from the other side of the net, it's Razlan with the seven already for the Athletics. So probably this is a third set. This is the time for Versosa to come alive. Something she needs to do. We know that she is the team captain and also the best scorer in her team. Oh. Good rally here. Masok yun, sabi ng Lions judge. That is going to be point number five for Espinosa, who is really helping out the cause of the athletics here. Oh, Espinosa with an off-speed hit there. Seeing a gaping hole. And pagkabalik sa kanya, they were ready for that regalo coming from Bertolano. Ito lamang nilang tatlo, inaalagaan nila. No? Oh, mm -hmm. This is not uh, a big lead, pero if they manage to hang in there, they might take this out away from Farm Fresh. It's a different energy that we're getting from Strong Group. Maybe they're saying this is the must-win third set, so they're leaving everything on the court here. And we Romero back on the court, Kate Verai as well. Crowd excited over seeing Kate on the court who made a lot of impact towards the latter part of the second set, by the way. Four points for Virai already, and she goes up, and she will score point number five. Oh, targeting zone five there from that set of Louis Romero. A very long down-the-line hit uh, working for Caitlin Virai. Chance here again. Oh, that one. And again, just a lot of things happening with Farm Fresh and Cruz is just quick to react to the ball. And the Falcon connection there. Uh, Romero to Cruz. And Riza Cruz adjusting mid air. Strong group. Unsuccessful in sustaining their lead here. Romero looking for Bertolano. Good combo play there. Bertolano earning her fifth point. Oh, Bertolano from that combination play at the middle. Razlan was there, pero medyo hindi lang niya na extend yung uh, defending arms niya doon. Uh, now uh, leading here, the Foxes after being down by three points. Razlan gets an opportunity to rest a Blessa in for the Athletics. Good approach, but look at that pickup by Melanie Romero. Kate Verai picked up there by Reblesa. Good effort by Strong Group to keep the ball in play. One more time, Romero looking for Kate. Romero working hard. Lazo there for Strong or for Farm Fresh, saving a lot of balls. A quick play, well read by the blockers of Farm Fresh and Laglag coming from strong group. You know, Onofre is the ninth best blocker in the league. It's um, not to discount her uh, impact, her ability to score here. Well, she's a good sized middle blocker. So if she can come alive at this time, together with Versosa, that effort, Raslan is already playing well. So. Strong group can still extend this. They're definitely not out of it yet. Oh, just a one point lead here. Technical timeout here. Third set.
Astig sa sports. This is a much closer third set. And definitely strong group has to come uh, strong as their name suggests because this is the last ditch effort. They have already given up the first two sets. Running attack for Onofre, picked up by Romero. It's a broken play, but Garay will make do. And again, uh, unforced error. This time coming from Farm Fresh. Oh, that was an unforced error from Virai. She knew that her contact from that attack was a bit low to her liking. And she quickly apologized to uh, Romero and the squad. Ooh, that's a nice set. Yeah, yeah. check ball. Oh, Cruz will get the, the check ball. And she will get a point. Yeah, you talk about that set. Just... See, si Louis Romero is so deceptive. I think yun yung kayo mga <laughs> magaling kayo mag poker eh. At yung mga setter, I think ish, you are also branded as somebody who is so unpredictable as a setter, which is the best kind of setter there can be. Hindi mo mabasa. Well, it's uh, the name of the game <laughs> of being a setter. Uh -oh. You have to be unpredictable. And you know, it's easier said than done because it is harder to communicate with uh, your, the rest of your players without being seen by the other team. Yeah. And also, it depends from the passes that you get from mm, your team. Naman. And so far, we have been lauding the defense that we are seeing from Farm Fresh, which really paves the way for the good plays that the setter is able to uh, execute. Oh, what about Caitlin Virai? Limited minutes, but already with Nine points coming off the bench here in this game against Strong Group. Oh, over dug there. Ah, that's a good effort there by Strong Group. It started off with that first attack that went over the two-man block. Oh, that is the aggressiveness that uh, we like to see mm -hmm. from Versoza. No? She has been silenced here so far in this game against Farm Fresh. No, halatang halatang pinag-aralan siya ng oh. Foxies in this game. Totoo yan. Only her fourth point. Espinosa with a good dig. Good coverage here by Strong Group from back row goes Espinosa. Another broken play. Oh, too close. Oh, look at Tapia making do and scoring off of that almost blunder. Great conversion there from the left side using her left hand. Mm -hmm. And there's two blockers in front of her. <laughs> uh, precision and the control yeah. needed for that point. Uh, a display of athleticism there from Tapia. And she will go again, this time with a proper set. But the two-man block of Strong Group was there. And Aukulan will earn her third point. That's a good block point from Strong Group. Uh, against Tapia. Uh, papansin natin na nakapag naka-establish yung double block ng strong group. More often than not, they get the block points that they want. Look at Louis Romero, but she is red by the other setter, Kaole. Tapia again, dug by Espinosa. Aslan finding the corner pocket we've seen. A lot of points coming off of that corner pocket shot. See, zone one is left empty a lot of times for Farm Fresh. That's a good transition point from Razdan. Just, just ready from that set and targeting zone one again. And we've got nine deadlocks already in this third set. Much, much closer. Strong group really putting a lot of effort. Look at that defense by Espinosa. Razdan will go again. Cut shot. Gets past Virai, and Strong Group takes the lead. Wow, what a point there from Strong Group. And Razlan again from the right wing, targeting zone one. Virai wasn't ready for that defensive stop. Time out here for Farm Fresh. Mind the lead set, lead set. Okay. Mind set, mind set. Focus on the side dog. Okay, side dog next to one point only. Okay, important, one point next. Atama, reset to shit. Reset, reset. Mindset, mindset, mindset. 
みんなでサイドアウト取りに行きましょうみんなで。It is telling Ish that Farm Fresh needed to call a timeout. I think the first the time that they initiated this timeout in the match. No, oh, they're down here by a point. The most crucial part, uh, arguably, of this set. Ooh. Back row attack by Ildefonso and using a soft touch to score. Oh, that's a good spot for PL Defonso to target because uh, Espinosa sagged to the right going to zone one. So nakita niya na butas yung kita ng zone six and zone five for that point. No, oh, mm -hmm. Chance here for strong group. Take the lead back. Oh. And we are talking about how Versosa really needs to come through. And this is the perfect timing for Versosa to get going. Well, they wanted to adjust their floor defense earlier. No? Sabi nila masyadong maraming uh, palo na humahaba. So kailangan depensa natin yung mahabang palo. But then again, yung mga top spin na may hina sa gitna pupunta, dun naman yung nagiging buta sa defensa ng Farm Fresh. Strong group in a uh, one-point lead here, late in the third set, and Ilde Fonso, third time's a charm. She had some difficulty getting that point in the last couple of sequences. Ilde Fonso targeting that seam in between the block of Anopre and Raslan. Oh, wow! Perfectly placed shot there! <laughs> That's the same area that was targeted earlier uh, by Versosa. And this time it's Onofre. Same spot and uh, another point uh, for strong group. We they, talked about on Onofre ish being the ninth best blocker, you were saying. Kailangan nilang galawan yung depends. Mm. Talking about Farm Fresh, they cannot afford to just wait. Napupunta sa pwesto nila yung bola. Just like that. That's yeah. a good defense. Good defense also on the side of Strong Group. Oh, great pancake defense by Delerio. But looks like we're going to get a challenge. Was it? Yeah, I don't think it was a good ball, but we'll see. Farm Fresh will challenge this one. It was too far from my point of view. You're talking about the pancake yeah, save? Yeah, the pancake which save. Which you, you think was, uh, was too late? Yeah. And the challenge will come from Farm Fresh because tinawag na ng out or ng dead ng ating first referee and coach Jerry and the rest of the Foxies insist that it is a good ball. Uh, our first referee took uh, some time before he called that uh, floor touch call. But we'll see in this challenge if he was right that to call that one. Whatever the result, you want to also take the time to talk about Janelle Delario and her efforts here. She is number nine in digs and receives, so definitely one of the assets of Farm Fresh. Oh! It hit her thumb mm -hmm. and uh, her... So it's considered a good pancake save. Yeah, we're gonna replay the point. That was a good challenge by Coach Jerry. And that validates Janelle Delario's efforts. Oh. Defonso making do with that set. Another chance here for Farm Fresh to counter. Defonso goes one more time. That cut shot is called inside. Two points in a row for Pia. Pia Defonso with that cut shot going cross court, just catching the line at the last second. Oh no, but medyo malayo pa nga sa lead. Oh, pasok na pasok yeah. eh, no? Gandang target for Pia at that last point. 
This is an exciting third set. Strong groove, definitely. In step with Farm Fresh, but Kate Verai. <laughs> she's making up for the last couple of errors she had on the attack. One more time on that. She's the lefty taking advantage of her position there as opposite of Emily Hatana. Palabas, palabas. Middle pass of option, middle, ah. Middle option. Sino ba yung nasa swagger doon? Ayaw mo ba doon sa ano? Kumuha ng bola. Three spike out, three spike out, three spike out. Kuha, off blocker. Atake tayo, atake tayo, pasa tayo. Pakay tayo. SGA, throw. Ate, Just a one-point advantage for Farm Fresh. Definitely the most exciting set we've seen. For those of you just joining us, first set won 25-10 for Farm Fresh, 25-15. The second one, so a totally different third set we're seeing. Different complexion here. And what changed for you, Ish? No, it's uh, the confidence of strong group no, that uh, built up no, in the last set. No? But look at the phone, so talk about confidence. That's three in a row for Pia. Boy, by her teammates and the trust that Louis Romero is giving her. It's Pia El Defonso and Kate in the right, eating up here the latter part of this third set uh, for the attack points of the Farm Fresh Foxes. This could be it for Farm Fresh. Let's see how strong group responds. Raslan. And that bounces off Pia El hand. Virai! And she will score the winning point. Resla tried, couldn't contain it. Kekarai ending with double digits. 11 points here after that great cut shot. Of course, the crowd appreciating that. <laughs> that was a powerful hit cross court to end us here in the third set of the match for the Farm Fresh Foxies, three to nothing, W for Farm Fresh. Gotta applaud the effort of strong group, particularly in this last set. Then we saw that if they willed it, they could actually pose as a threat to their opponent. But Farm Fresh will walk away with a straight set win. 25, 22 that last set.